Good morning. Welcome to Rajagiri School of Engineering and Technology. I am Dr. Unikrishnan PC, Professor, Electrical and Electronics Engineering Department, Rajagiri School of Engineering and Technology. I will be teaching you the course MCN201, namely Sustainable Engineering, in this semester. Before going through the course, let me give a brief introduction about myself. I did my B.Tech in Electrical and Electronics Engineering from NSS College of Engineering, Palkat during 1981 to 85. I did my M.Tech in Control and Instrumentation from IIT Bombay. And I did my PhD in Electrical and Electronics Engineering from Kapagam University, Coimbatore. Now, let me go through the a brief description about my teaching career. I started teaching in 1986 and from 1986 to 1996, that is almost one decade, I worked as assistant professor and associate professor in Rajasthan Technical University, Kota. And from 1996 to 2016, which means two decades, I hold various positions in Colleges of Technology, Ministry of Manpower, Muscat. I worked there as Assistant Professor, Academic Coordinator, Registrar, Head of Section and Head of the Department. And from 2016 onwards, I am working here in Rajagiri School of Engineering and Technology as Professor in Electrical and Electronics Engineering Department. So let us have a brief description about the syllabus of sustainable engineering. There are five modules and the first module uh, deals with sustainability. The second module deals with environmental pollution. The third one deals with environmental management standards. The fourth module deals with resources and its utilization and the last module deals with sustainability practices. The assessment pattern of this course is given here. There will be two continuous assessment tests of 50 marks each and an end semester examination of 100 marks. The continuous internal evaluation pattern is given here. Attendance carries 10 marks. Continu continuous assessment test, which we had seen just now. There will be two continuous assessment tests, 50 each, which will be averaged to 25. Then assess assignment quiz course project carries 15 marks. So altogether, CIE carries 50 marks and end semester examination or ESE carries 100 marks and the total mark is 150. The final examination and semester examination duration is 3 hours. This is the end semester examination pattern. There will be two parts, part A and part B. In part A, there will be two questions from each module. So there will be 10 questions of 3 marks each, so total 30 marks. In part B, you have to answer one question out of two questions from each module. And each question carries 14 marks. So in part B, a total of 5 questions you have to answer, each carrying 14 marks. So the total for part B is 70 marks and the grand total is 100 marks. These are various reference books you should go through and enrich yourself. There are eight different reference books available. And with that, we end this session. See you again in the next session. Thank you very much.